In Zurich, an old factory is being dismantled. Today, demolishing buildings has become almost as complex as building them. We separate wood from concrete and other materials. The concrete can be used again for premium reinforced concrete. The mixed rubble also goes to make new concrete. After the building has been torn down, a giant magnet pulls out small bits of iron from the rubble. Waste is increasingly regarded as a valuable source of raw materials. Experts refer to the procedure of recovery as urban mining. Switzerland doesn't have many natural resources, but when you see all the metal left in our building rubble, Switzerland is actually a country rich in raw materials. We should no longer look at building debris as a pile of waste, but as a mine of raw materials. And it's a mine which, far from getting exhausted, actually gets bigger every year. The building debris is processed in special concrete factories, such as this plant in Rümlang. The amount of recycled raw material has increased so much that new uses have to be found for it. Up to now, this recycled material has been used for sewers and road construction, but now supply is exceeding demand. We have to start making premium materials that can be used for building houses. But not only construction waste has become valuable. Household waste, too, contains precious materials. This waste incineration plant near Zurich runs 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. A new high-tech procedure has been developed here to separate out raw materials from the slag. We recover all sorts of metals, mainly aluminium, but also copper, tin, zinc, lead, as well as precious metals, such as gold, silver and palladium. The plant receives regular visits from international waste delegations to learn more about their new procedure. It seems that urban mining has a great potential.